Hey, it's Boo. Chris and I were just sitting down having some lichen tea, and guess who stopped by? Steve Lewis from the Toby Attic Wilderness Committee. Believe it or not, Steve and Chris had worked together on helping save the Toby Attic, and they've never met. They've only discussed by email, so... It's a pleasure to meet you, Steve. And same. It is yeah, a pleasure. Congratulations on all your hard work and Well, success. thank you, and it's, uh, yeah, it's been uh, seven or eight years since I started seeing your emails, yeah, even before that. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Been, uh, having and a lot of fun over the years. Yeah. <laughs> The Toby Atwell's committee uh, played a uh, major role, uh, probably the major role, in saving the Toby Attic area. So what's the next step for you guys? Well, the next step is uh, that uh, we do have a management plan in place. Um, and uh, we're, at, we're at the point now where what we want to get additions to the core area. And they are integral to the ecosystems. And government was meant to get back to us within a period of time after the plan right. was signed and we're still working to have a, a range of the meeting. And if people want to learn more about this or help out, is there a place they can go? Well, we don't, we do have a website yeah. and uh, when we, very shortly we'll be meeting with Don, who's the chair of the Toby Attic Wilderness Committee, and he can excellent. fill you in on, on where to find that information. That's excellent. And then, understanding that area, there's also, that's where the mainland moose are threatened, is Absolutely. Correct? Well, the Chris would know even more about this, but of course the main moose are a, a distinct species in mainland Nova Scotia right. as against what's in Cape Breton Island. Right. And uh, they are, are do they have endangered status now? They're provincially That's, endangered. Yes, right. Yeah. Yeah. And we're going to go talk to Don Rice, who's also who's the chair, as you said, right. of the Toby Attic Wilderness Committee, and he's going to tell us some more about that. Yeah, because of course Don's uh, began the committee in 1992 right. when they got wind of large forest companies going to yeah. go in and decimate these core, which is now the Toby Attic Wilderness. And where's Don located? He's in Bear River. And we are going to, I don't know how. We're going to go do, we're going to do a road trip. So we're going to go to Bear River. Let's go, you guys. Okay. Excellent. Don't bears eat kids.